my friends and everyone who is joining me to watch my uh, Shakespeare setup and uh, what I think about it. Um, I will introduce you to this is my Shakespeare. It's in size wide, and I um, house Kair notebooks in here, and I have a beautiful charm here. It says dream. And yes, I bought two pieces, uh, the hook and the charm itself, and I crafted it. That was a first for me to do that. And I did change my string to a silver color. And originally, this is not a black color. The original color is this, this beautiful blue. But you see what happened is I have dropped a few oil spots or it was uh, dirty spots and I ended up with like a big spot here and then here and you know what I did I start wiping the leather why I know I'm not supposed to do that but I still did it so I had to color it in black I was told that there no other color can cover it other than black and I like it though it's nice and black it's beautiful and I did paint it myself so yay for me it was first time also so this is my setup that's how it looks inside it has pockets I would say I don't really use pockets I prefer um, to have sticky notes stuck onto the dashboard and um, I do like a just regular like one let's say one uh, half pocket on the side and maybe it's just too much pockets for me I don't really use them but I do love how it looks. So this is my dashboard. I post my uh, post-it notes and tags, and then uh, I have like things that I want to check out. My uh, paper flags. This is my notebook. I do like study notes here. There's a lot of notes I did. Like all of these are actually like a little stickers that I stick. Uh, there were actually like a whole sheet of um, dot stickers that I ordered from eBay. Um, this is more like an example how I do it. Um, this was, uh, I was uh, looking up information on YouTube, how to read body language. I am fascinated by body language. I love it. I think it's the most amazing thing God has created for people, given people. And so this is like that. So I do decorate sometimes like I have a stamp here like just repeating the same stamp <laughs> so I I almost finished my notebook which is a big thing for me because let's just say I had this notebook for a half a year now and having it almost finished is actually nice <laughs> it feels good it feels good but I don't write as much as some other people do. This is a notebook that I have uh, created for myself. It's a little booklet. And um, I love the, the drawings of women like this, like fashion women. <laughs> and I decided I'm like, I'm going to have it in my booklet. So this is my booklet. This is post-it notes, my lists, my quotes. And this is my Bible study notebook and let's just say I have a lot of like a lot of notes like a lot of uh, books that I read that have uh, study guides with them like this is a jewel in his crown by uh, Priscilla Schreier and I did the sample and I liked it that was pretty good um, and other Bible studies other just notebooks and Yep, and I almost finished it too because see, I have notes in here too. I kind of jump sometimes when I don't finish my study. So this is the second part of the dashboard that I did. I make my own dashboards. I bought finally a laminator and I um, make my own dashboards. And yes, I am kind of fascinated sometimes to read about cancer therapies. Uh, mainly as you can see like ozone therapy b17 I like holistic medicine too uh, I myself a nurse and I love holistic medicine because then you can understand both sides of it 
like you can understand the scientific biological uh, conventional medicine and then you can combine it with holistic and you're like oh this makes sense then you're like the other thing you hear is like no this doesn't make sense <laughs> and uh, we're almost finished so this is like a picture of me this is a quote that a uh, bible quote that i wrote for myself yes for myself i love myself it is commandment from God, love yourself, and then love your neighbor. This is a bullet journal. Um, I print these bullet journals myself, and let me tell you, I made it. <laughs> I can do it, and uh, you can do it too. It's not that hard. It takes trial and error and a few wasted pages, but it's okay. Um, I got it from Morgan, and uh, it's on Etsy, and that's how it looks inside. And then how that's how it looks on the back. Less stuff like that. And that's the end of it. And this is the back pocket. I don't really use it. To me, it's kind of useless. I love using the pen loop, but it still looks nice with pockets. I love my uh, cover with pockets. So that's the setup that I have for my Chic Sparrow. And I looking forward to seeing you in the next video oh i might as well say that i like the leather that it's not too too stiff it feels nice and uh, it looks beautiful and it holds everything so well the work is well made it's definitely worth the money that you pay for it even though i think it's very expensive like this notebook came out to 117 dollars us so, which I think is very expensive, but the work is quality. So you're not getting no cheap work for so much high price. Well, good luck. Bye-bye. Have fun.